Or are we going to discuss the boy becoming a bear? Yeah, are we? Not now. We need to repair the protection stave and get home. What happened to the protection stave? You did. So you're blaming me? I am not blaming you, Atreus. Well, tell your voice that. Besides your gift of language and hearing creatures' thoughts, are there any other new magical abilities to report? Not really. What of Fenrir? What about him? When he died, you cast a spell. No, I didn't. But I saw light. I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm. Trick of Fimblewinter, perhaps. Seen my share. <laughs> with all the blood. Yours, Atreus. Seriously? That, or any prey you might have been dragging, I suppose. Not sure that makes me feel any better. Yeah! <laughs> 
Joseph! Bojte zdrav! Nisa! Wow. A lot of those guys. It's been like this all night. They must have been inside the stable when I fixed it. Yeah. What are we still doing out here, brother? Let's go home. Go home. Sometimes I really wish Tyr's temple still worked so we could get out of Midgard. They say Fimblewinter affects all realms, lad. Okay, but how could things be any worse than here? Hey, Spana. You're not scared. You're a brave girl. Good. Great girl. Atreus! Right. I'm just checking on... To bed! Yes, sir. As evenings go, that was entirely too eventful. Though I admit it was a bit like old times there. For a moment. The three of us navigating some hitherto unhappened-upon patch of forest. Been a while since you've joined us. If that's what you mean. Ah, well, just tired, I suppose. You've seen one deer hunt, you've seen them all. How can you feel tired when you never sleep? There are other kinds of tired, lad. You'll see when you're older. <laughs> <laughs> 